she took us through Kenjen, Kentraco, and KPLC. And what has come out clearly is that KPLC is no longer interested in serving the citizens and giving power to its citizens and to the nation. But it has just become a rotten den where cartels have taken control. How on earth does KPLC buy power from Kenjen at five shillings and sell it to its suppliers at 23 shillings. The same KPLC goes ahead and signs some agreements with the IPPS to sell, uh, to buy power from them at 52 shillings, surely. And then there is an agreement there is a clause in this agreement where I, I think I understood it's a take or buy. Whether you buy the electricity or the power, you still have to pay for this power. Yet Kenjen is supplying power at five shillings and we are not exhausting the power at Kenjen. It shows that there are cartels that are controlling Kenya power. And this has to come to an end. Because power is a commodity which, uh, which is of utmost need uh, for our citizens, for our hospitals, for the industries, and also for the investors that want to come to invest in our country. Power is one of the few items that they will check on the cost of power in the country. So how long will we suffer?